It's only 10 o'clock. I'm already getting the sunscreen on. I think that's going to be a uh, sign of things to come for today. Out doing a 200 today. First one in a good while. Last one I did was in mid-March. It's now uh, almost the end of May. I guess it's going to go one or two ways. Either uh, my legs are going to be well rested or they're going to be totally behind the programme. So uh, I guess we'll find out. I'm currently heading west. Uh, heading over towards Hartlebury or just south of Hartlebury. Then I'll be turning south then, getting across the River Severn um, and kind of weaving left and right down the side of the River Severn past Worcester all the way on to uh, Malvern. A little bit further south, get back across the river again. Then I'm going to go north, snaking around again up the side of the Severn, probably as far as Worcester and then cut across the east then pretty much through Barnt Green and back into Kings Heath. One of the goals today is to uh, be as self-sufficient, well, to be 100% self-sufficient. I've got a little packed lunch here in my uh, trusty bar bag for a uh, little picnic in the park in Malvern. I've got three bottles with me, so hopefully that's going to get me to Malvern without uh, me dehydrating into a crisp. I've also done a bit of research on where I can get my bottles filled in Malvern. Um, I found a tap that I should be able to access. There is the uh, Enigma fountain, of course, in, in Malvern, but I'm not sure if that's actually switched on at the moment. I heard it might not be. I'm going to swing by there anyway and just check it out for the future. The whole point of this, of course, is that I don't want to go into shops, really just trying to kind of do everything I can not to uh, risk spreading anything around and I feel actually doing things in a little bit more of a self-supported manner is uh, kind of taking me back to uh, a bit more by a kind of bikepacking roots really. to me. A couple of scotch eggs, ham and cheese wrap, end of the crisps. That's a mighty fine scotch egg. It's a very good little feed now here in Malvern. Nice break just at the right time. Yeah, got my bottles filled, so uh, happy days. So what is it with me and tractors? You are kidding me, right? I literally have to go a hundred yards down this road to get a square. Uh. I guess that's going to be about an hour, I guess, roughly. It got pretty hot this afternoon. Enjoyable ride, though. I think the ride's going to end up being around about 210 by the time I get back with all the little details I've had to do. No, it's not so bad. But yeah, I'm just going to say bye from the road now and I'll round this one up later. So I've even been able to get home and uh, finish this off with a massive slice of homemade lemon drizzle cake. 
like a proper road axe and everything. So it ended up being 211k in the end, 2,300 meters of climbing. So it generally felt really good up until about 195k. And then that last 15k or so, it was almost like flicking a switch and suddenly was really tired. Considering how long it's been since I've done anything over about 120k, the heat, the fact that I wasn't really on the freshest of legs either. I'm, I'm reasonably happy with that today. Ultimately though, it was just a really enjoyable ride, which, uh, you know, trumps everything else.